and welcome to Pat Metheny fragment number two. I'm Philly Philozola, and I hope you enjoyed lick number one. If you haven't seen it, please check it out. Um, the link is right here. And um, let's get on to lick number two. And it goes like this. One, two. A one, two, three, four. So, once again, it's played in C minor, where you can see it as E flat, major 7 over here, the relative. And I'll play it solely with the tabs, and I'll speed it up, and I'll explain what's going on. Alright, so 3, 4, sorry, 3, 4. important things here is this part which you can go pick everything and then pull off this last these last two or go right or, all right and then the other part is this very common in jazz if you want to get this articulation down you could practice those four three two one with actually this articulation. To so get used to that, so. I actually pick up and um, pull off these other two. practice this, like I said on the first lick, all over the neck. Ah! Well, I screwed that one up. Anyways, um, yeah, you want to isolate this. to that and this or, and do that see I repeated that three times um, on a descending line it's kind of repetitive but that's what you do to get used to it and then you kind of you know try to branch out of that and not just do that in your solos but that's the idea, so I'll do it with the metronome, just so you can have an idea. Two, and one, two, three, four. So that's basically it. Um, work on that. Uh, once again, if you want the tabs, um, like the actual image, I always post it on my uh, Facebook page, which is facebook.com slash phillyphilozola. Please like the video, share it with your friends, work on this lick, comment, tell me if it's useful or not, and um, I'll see you for lick number three. Thank you.